Hey guys, welcome to part 18 of Let's Play Super Mario 64 DS. In the last part, we had a mixed time, I, I guess it's the best word, um, in Snowman's Land, and now we have to kind of finish it off. So, for this one, apparently I have to go back to the place where I was before, because this is, oh, it's the Silver Stars, and I do like the Silver Star one, you know. Uh, I, I find them kind of a not. I can't stop slip sliding all over the place. It's embarrassing. Um, yeah, I do like the Silver Stars ones, although I don't like the fact that you lose the Silver Star. I think that's kind of a bit unnecessary. Like, I'm not, you know. I think I already talked about this, about the multiplayer, but, you know, still, it's pretty cool, I guess. Okay. See, I should have been Luigi. I knew this whole time I should have been Luigi. Oh, what a fool I've been. Okay, so, this is pretty much, this replaces the eight red coins one that was in the original. Because in the original you had to do the same thing, where you had to come up here, jump in this box, or jump on top of the box, jump, there we go. And then land on the Koopa shell, and then you, you know, go all over the place and get the red coins. Or not. Come on, I'm meant to be sliding forward, Luigi, not messing around. But yeah, in this oh, where oh okay, that didn't go smoothly. But yeah, in this one they replaced it with the silver stars because I guess they didn't really have any real ideas for doing an another star in this place. So instead they were just like ah, we'll just do a silver star one. It's kind of a shame. It it's got, it is a bit out of place the silver star one. Because there is still an eight red coins one in this one, so it seems weird that they would replace the eight red. They would replace the eight red coin one with a silver star one, and then add in a new eight red coin one. It seems like you know that's not the way you would do it, would it? Is it? And also, I'm Luigi for a couple of reasons. One, you know, because he's awesome, and two, because we actually need him for this star. And I saw. Oh, I can't. So now we have to go into the igloo. That's how. The... See, I still can't make it up there. I don't know why. I don't know why they changed that, and I don't know why there's so many slopes. I swear there wasn't last time. Yeah, we're just gonna have to do this tradish, or we can actually try this. Um, well that didn't work. Let's let's try it again. You can get over here. You you can get over there somehow. I don't know. Because it's once again, if we could just jump up, if we could just jump up there, that would make this star kind of a bit easier. But instead we have to go all the way around. Seems a bit silly if you ask me. But then this is kind of like the least remarkable uh, snow level in the game, so... I would say anyway. Oh no! <coughs> oh. First of all I had to cough, that was a big one no, but... Oh, okay, no. Oh! Did they change that, did they? Oh, thanks game. See, you're meant to go up there, where those coins are leading, but... You you don't have to, I swear you don't have to. Unless, it looks like they might have changed it so you have to. I don't know, they made this level like ten times worse. Okay, there we go. <laughs> see, I don't know how you're meant to figure that out, because it's really hidden. I don't think, it's really hard to see the igloo if you don't know it's there. So, it's one of those things where you, if you know it's there, then it's fine, but otherwise you're just kind of like, you know, you see the description, into the igloo, and then you're just like, well, okay, cool. That, I'm, I'm happy for the igloo, but... And this is, oh, this has been redesigned. I have to say, I don't really like it, but mainly because there's so many of those floating guys, and those floating guys, their pattern, or the way they move, is just so kind of annoying. And also, you know, there were, I think, no, that I want to say there were penguins in the one before, but I don't think that's true. But I like the original igloo. The the original igloo actually did kind of feel like a suit, like a little mini world in the stage. But that igloo kind of feels more like, oh, you're actually kind of in that igloo. You found 80 power stars. The mystery of the endless stairs is solved. Oh, okay, whatever that is. Thanks to you. Is Bowser ever upset? Now on to the final showdown. Well, nowhere close, actually. 
<laughs> game. I appreciate the enthusiasm, but no, nope, I still gotta keep trucking on. Because I promised to do all 150. In case you can't tell, I'm definitely regretting promising to do all 150. I'm gonna do it, because I do wanna, you know, get 100% in this game. If there's one game I should be getting 100% in, it's Super Mario 64. You know, I've got the time, I can practice off screen, I can research and all that, so I should be able to do it. But yeah, looking on back on some of these stars, oof, it's a rough one. But this star isn't, yeah, because you're meant to go get the shell to do this, but I don't know why you would bother. I don't think I've ever gotten the shell to go up here. Like, I can't remember in the original what it's like, but, you know, because you're only Mario in the original, so you can't do Luigi's awesome back jump, but I know it wasn't too bad. Oh, I know it was easier. So, so yeah, so now there's eight red coins in here, which is kind of odd. I, I really don't know what the d thinking was behind it. I guess the thinking was they wanted to do something new, and they thought the igloo was the best place to, like, you know, reinvent it and do something different with it, but then they didn't really have any idea, so they were just like, ah, oh, we'll just do the eight red coins in there, and then we'll just do the silver stars in there. Although I'm not going to complain, because this eight red coins is super easy. All you got to do, especially with Luigi, I think, it, oh, oh dear. See, I guess they, it, I guess it wasn't a case of they had no ideas, it was just their idea was terrible. Like, why would you add in more of this? This, The mechanic of this, jumping on top of their heads, didn't work in the original too well. So I don't know why they would then be like, hey, we should make players do more of it. This kind of seems like an odd decision. Like, what you know, one of those decisions that developers make, and you can tell they just made it because they're the develop because, you know, developers have different kind of preferences, or there are certain things about their game they like more than the players kind of like. And I think the developer might be like... Or well, Nintendo were probably a bit too into the idea of like, hey, we can have propeller thing. What a wonderful gimmick we've come up with. No one will ever get tired of that, or annoyed with it. Yeah, but how could anyone get annoyed with this? So the last one is underwater. I just there is a I just they do so much damage as well. Wow, I you die really quickly in there. Okay, so now I can't Okay, so there's coins there. Let's just talk to the bob on. There's not I think there's two bob bombs on here actually. Uh it's in the middle there. By any chance is that where a ton of stupid things are? Yep. Apparently it's here. Oh, it is there. Okay. Oh, I did it. We. Hang out. I'm about to get killed. Hopefully not. So yeah. So I don't really like what they do with this igloo. There's there's a lot more interesting things you could do within an igloo, you know. And the original design was a lot more kind of cool. There's a lot of redundant space in that igloo, but it was definitely a lot better. But oh, I can't complain because I just beat Snowman's Land. And now I'm gonna do something that's gonna make me feel really sad and depressed inside, or something I don't want to do. I kind of uh, was thinking about it, and I can't keep doing levels when I haven't beat Shifting Sandland, so I, I have to go back and do it. I can't keep putting it off. Because I'm putting off a lot of stars with this Let's Play. You know, if you're a fan of this game, which you should be then you will definitely know that I've put off quite a lot of stars just to... Um, now I'm going to be Luigi. Yeah, I've put off a lot of stars here and just skipped a lot. There's a load of secret stars I've missed, but I want to try and keep, make sure I'm getting all the main stars at least. Yeah, I've missed all the 100 coins ones. Uh, the metal cap one, I didn't go there. Haven't gone to the vanish cap yet. There's a ton of stuff to do. Although I think that's the, you know, half the half the appeal of this game. And why people you kinda love it or hate it. Cause you get all this choice. Alright, pyramid puzzle. Let's do this. So the first thing we have to do is go back into the pyramid, which I mean, awesome. Oh, I've already oh, this is just going wonderfully. I was already punched in the head. Um, so I think did I come up with a shortcut for this last time? I, I want to say I did. For getting into the pyramid. Oh, oh. Oh, okay. This might work. Come on, come on, come on, come on. 
Oh, look at that. Look at that. That spin is so overpowered. It's great. I love it. It's so overpowered. I don't... You could probably come up with some really great shortcuts in this game. Because with the original, there was a ton of great shortcuts. Uh, but with this game, I think you could come up with, like, even more. Okay, so I'm in the pyramid. And I know what the original was. Or the original puzzle was. Oh... Cause this, I hate this one. I, I've always hated this one. I, I don't want to make, I don't want to make this the complaining episode where I'm just complaining. But I, I need to. No, no. Why? Why would you put the Wario cap there? There's no reason to be Wario in this section. But yeah, um, this one is really quite terrible. This star. It's a really bad idea. It's a bad idea, p poorly executed. I'm gonna say. Cause um, there's quite. We haven't seen these yet, but there's some puzzle stars. Or they're kind of cool puzzle stars, or that's how they're kind of labelled. No, don't you dare get that star. But, in the later levels, the puzzle ones, they're, they're okay. They're not a terrible idea, and they get better, and they become okay. But in this, this first one is terrible. Because, oh, uh, what this actually, this is the silver star one. But in the original, you had to collect five coins. And then you had to collect them... You didn't have to do them in order, but you had to go and collect five coins. So that, that, this is the first silver star right here. If Luigi will go and get it. But what you have to do, you have to follow that path, right? Can I look at it? Yeah, you have to follow that path all the way along. And look, you have to just randomly drop down. You know, just randomly drop down. That's fun. With this game camera, that, that is going to be so much fun. So I'm really hoping I do this first time, but from my experience with this Let's Play and <laughs> past past times, I'm not going to have a fun time doing this. I might do. Maybe. Nothing has gone wrong yet. It was just this was annoying in the original as well. Because so. there's just some stars that you kind of hate. I think I might have, to do, might have to do that top 10 list. Top 10 stars I hate in Super Mario 64. You can probably guess what they are just by watching this Let's Play, but still, I think that'd be a good video. You know, there's a lot of positive lists about Mario games. Why not make a couple of negative ones, I'm thinking? Do something a bit different. Okay, so... Yeah, so at least with this one, I have the bottom screen that shows me the locations of the Silver Stars. So I can judge it better than I would in the original. Because it's literally just coins! And I don't know how you're supposed to figure it out that this is what you're meant to be doing. Okay. Right, so it's there. What button do I go down with? I can't see. I can't see! <laughs> Alright, well, I guess I have to use the manual controls. No? Not today? Alright, not today then, I guess. Yeah, I thought Luigi. Okay, down. No, down. Right there. Oh, this is terrifying. Okay, so that's right there. Oh, that was close. And then it's right down there. Oof, okay. Okay, I did it. <laughs> Everything's fine. I can sigh, br you know, breath of relief. I think all you've got to do is just let it go. Because that's the thing, it's, it's called a puzzle. And the whole puzzle is that you're meant to just go down here, but it's not really a puzzle. You're not really figuring it out. Well, it's either not a puzzle or a really horrible puzzle, because it would mean that the puzzle is figuring out that there's a puzzle, <laughs> pretty much. You're figuring out the puzzle of the puzzle, which is now getting a bit too existential. I think I said that word wrong, but whatever, who cares. Alright, so I've kind of done something really dumb. I should have been Luigi for this, but you know what, whatever. I already tried this, I can't believe I'm doing this again. This actually isn't that bad, this one. I kind of did make it out to be really horrible, this star, but it's not that bad. I think I'm going to use the cannon, although I can't remember if I've activated it. Because there's pretty much, there's four stars, like, all around. And then there's... <laughs> stupid Mario hat. And then there's four stars, um... Oh, what am I doing here? Then there's four stars in the sky. So I think I'm going to kill this guy, which I feel bad about. I don't like killing the Goombas with the hats on, they look adorable. I don't want to kill them. Okay, so now I can't... Wait, where are the other stars? Or do I have coins? Oh, no! Well! 
Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure if each character's long jump is different, but I don't know. Because honestly, I have no real... I don't really care about showing off this star. I hate it that much. I hate this world that much. So I think I'm going to try and show off where some of the coins are. But if I die again, I'm just going to cut to me getting the star. That's how much resentment I have. Resentment I have for this level. Um, that's odd. That used to go all the way down. Although it's pretty cool. In this version, they made the sand dark, so you can actually differentiate it. Because in the original, it wasn't. So you would just accidentally fall down in there. There you go. There, now you're dead. So getting that red coin was actually really hard. Which is why you kind of had to get it at straight away. Okay, go away, Goomba. I don't don't want to deal with you. So there's one. I swear there's one over there. Okay, so there's one there. Oh, I'm I'm dead. No, I'm not dead. Okay, cool. And then there's one by the oasis that we've already seen. So now what I'm going to do? Jump, make it. Oh, so I'm just going to go use. The, oh, I didn't get the cannon. Oh. I swear I did, but whatever. See, this is pretty cool. Once you realise this shortcut, that you can just long jump. It's so satisfying going over those. Of course, it also can be really infuriating going over those, because you can easily mess up and die, like I just did, but whatever. Oh, what? Oh, oh so unnecessary. Just so unnecessary, you stupid bird. I hate you. <laughs> You're the worst. That's my hat. Or my brother's hat. Which actually means I was wearing a, my brother's hat on my hat. A hat over a hat. That, that seems really silly. Go! Oh, oh no. Oh no. What? Oh! Okay. Sure. Why not? I'll accept that. That was really odd. I didn't even get the... C <sighs> okay, let's go back and get the cannon. Oh dude, this is going terribly. I'm enjoying myself more than I... F okay, now, now I'm dead. What? Alright, what I'm going to do... I'm going to go get, go be Mario. I'm going to cut to... Uh, me... I'm going to show off where the four other coins are. And then I'm going to cut to me getting the star. So, I'll see you in a bit. There we go. That took way too many attempts. <laughs> I got the other ones just fine. What was up with that red coin? Why's it got to be like that? Oh well, it doesn't matter. I got the, I got the star, and I never have to. I do have to come back here again. Oh. Well, that won't be for a good while. So um. Next time in this play Super Mario 64 DS, we are going to start World 11. So I've been on Storm 23. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you next time.